This is a brand new discovery. I have found ancient knowledge that was lost for who knows how long, centuries, millennia. You may have wondered at some point in your life why Thursday comes in between Wednesday and Friday. It seems no one in living memory can answer that question, uh, but I have figured it out using math. It's The math itself is quite simple. There are just a lot of interconnected details, which only someone familiar with this particular subject, mathematical subject matter, would even really think about. So you've probably heard of the Fibonacci sequence that is central to all of this, uh, but you probably haven't heard it, well some of you have, of modular arithmetic. And so in the next video I will explain how modular arithmetic works. It's basically clock arithmetic. For example, we could call this a seven hour clock because it goes around in a circle and it has seven hours. And in this case, the hours are the days of the week. And you may or may not have learned that each day of the week is associated with the planet from the moon to Mars, Mercury, Jupiter, Venus, Saturn, and the Sun, Sunday, Moon Day, Saturn Day. The other ones, if you know other languages, may be familiar as well. And you're probably wondering why these numbers aren't 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. This is going to be explained in the subsequent videos. But first we have to learn modular arithmetic. And then when we learn modular arithmetic, we're going to learn how to create the zodiac. All right, so this is one o'clock Aries. It's generally agreed that Aries comes at one o'clock. It's called the first house in astrology and goes all the way around to the 12th house of Pisces. So the zodiac is essentially a 12 hour clock. Coming back to modular arithmetic. Um, but before uh, we explain the zodiac, um, we're going to need to learn modular arithmetic. I have to give credit, so the this zodiac, this is my particular design, but I did not discover this mathematical connection myself. That was, well, I learned of it from Russell von Olhausen and David Cochran, who has a YouTube channel called Cosmic Cybernetics. So I happen to be studying that same area of mathematics and discovering how it's connected to time. And I wondered if other people were finding such connections, had anything documented. And so I found this, these, those two, I mentioned David Cochran and Russell von Olhausen, had created something much like this, which I've put my own design onto. And this is the key, was the key to discovering how the days of the week come into order. So, now let's get into the modular arithmetic in the next video.